attached to my uh, newly Black Widow, I guess you could say, PV Woman 5Hs. Uh, I was waiting till today to blast them, and this guy, I said, was making some scratching sounds. Well, after playing a little bit of uh, some bassy music, like I said, those sounds went right away. You might also know that there is a 60 hertz hum. That is because that old piece of shit 260C amp, when it's not down there, you might notice, when it is not plugged into a non, when it's plugged into a non-grounded outlet, it hums like a bitch. And it's highly annoying. Not gonna lie with you. Let me see if I can't fix that. Alright, there. I plugged it into a grounded outlet, so it should sound better now. Um, anyhow, these guys, I definitely would say, gained a lot of volume. Uh, another thing I would say about them is they definitely did produce a lot more bass. Unfortunately, though, I think these cabinets just prevent them from really pumping the extra bass because even with Black Widows in them, it did make a huge difference, but not the difference I was really expecting. Then again, I'm using that piece of crap amp, and I, I did order a better amp. Uh, that'll be coming soon. It is a PV uh, CS400. It's the one with DDT compression, so I don't have to worry about blowing out my speakers. Because I actually could blow these... And I don't think I can blow these guys out. I think these guys would survive. But, um... Yeah, the Black Widows make a huge difference in sound quality. I'm not gonna lie with you guys. Um... Another thing I'd say is I did just order some of these. These are Black Widow equipped logos. Um, because you know I said screw it. I put I have to put one over there. But I figured if I have Black Widows, everyone needs to see that I do. <laughs> because you know these are nice speakers, very very nice speakers. Very glad I got this one fixed. For those who do not know what happened is that vo uh, gunk uh, got lodged in the voice coil of this one and it locked up. Um, with a little bit of repair, rubbing alcohol, and time and effort, I was able to restore this woofer back to working order. And it definitely was worth it. Even though I put about five hours into cleaning that shit out. But I won't say it wasn't worth it, because I was actually going to blow up that woofer thinking it was, that it was a bad cone kit. And it was a good thing I took... And the thing about Black Widows and Scorpion Series PV speakers is you can actually take off the magnets off of them to see actual damage and I did and I won't say it wasn't worth it because I did see that this guy was working correctly or it was okay I just needed to clean up the gunk in it um overall I'd say that the uh, replacement was definitely worth it I'm not hearing any ear air leaks uh, so everything sounds like it's uh, working correctly definitely worth it guys not gonna lie with you so anyhow, thank you guys for watching, comment, rate, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.